सो हाई डियर कैंसर अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू यू गायस दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जनरल लव रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द कैंसर सन मून वीनस राइजिंग Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the roles can no roles actually. Uh, the second thing, this is a reading from 11 till the 21st of July, and this is for singles only. I'm going to tap into your current energies, and I will see what are your energies for a new person, new connection, and if somebody from your past is coming back, and the guidance. So let's start. Your current energies right now at this present moment: Cancer, Sun, Moon, Venus, or Rising singles. Let's see what are your current energies right now at this present moment. We have the ten of cups and the four of wands and the knight of wands. Bottom of the deck is the four of swords. Okay, you are trying to find your happily ever uh, ever after cancer, and you are ready to take every like action, every step possible from your side to make this happen, to make this uh, happen in the three D world, in the physical world. I feel uh, cancer, you are done with all the clingy and shitty and not so uh, like. Uh, hopeful and positive kind of thing in your life and you are like okay this time i'm just going to find someone with whom i'm going to spend the rest of my life with i you feel like you should not play any kind of games you should not give your energy and time to on and off in and out kind of immature kind of energies you should be with a stable energy with a stable person who is going to provide you uh, the stable kind of relationship the connection that you're yearning for from a very long time i think cancer in the past you were with a person who like with whom you tried your best you gave your best to that person to to that situation but no matter what you did it didn't worked out and you kind of failed in that very terribly so you are in this energy of okay now i'm single now i'm going to start my life with scratch and now i'm going to go with someone or something that's going to provide me the stability the long term partnership and the happily ever after that i'm looking forward to because i don't uh, want any more immature kind of energies in my life and i feel like i should just heal myself you are in on the healing journey at the same time you are very clear you don't want any kind of on and off in and out all you need is a stable and mature and grounded kind of uh, connection in your life and you are ready to put in the effort and energy from your side to make this happen okay this is what your current energies are telling me let's see what are your energies for a new person or new connection or new situation if someone new is adding up in your life in these 10 11 days We have the four of cups, the knight of swords, and hanged man. Bottom of the deck is the two of swords, uh, two of wands. Sorry, we have the two of wands. Yeah. See, four of cups and the knight of swords and the hanged man is telling me, Cancer, that I do see you having options. If you don't have options right now, you will be having options very very soon. But you are going to be quite confused, quite unhappy about those options. So you will be cutting those options out of your life. and you will be in this energy of trying to see things from a different perspective understanding that uh, you uh, these options are not meant for you or uh, you are simply not uh, you have simply not met the one for you right now so you will be just uh, cutting this uh, these options these people out of your life with whom you are not able to see a uh, future with or with whom you are not able to align your energies with you are like okay i should uh, just uh, surrender i should just stay still and the right person right energy will start coming to me the moment i will start surrendering to the divine and not doing much about it on the physical level so you will be waiting for the right person right energy although you will be having options you might not be very happy about that so yes a new person like i do see options i don't i don't see one option i do see options coming in new people new energies adding up but i don't see you very much interested in them so you feeling very happy about them sorry about that i don't see that happening uh let's see what are your energies for a past person past connection if somebody from your past is coming back or showing up in your life we have the lovers the page of cups and the eight of swords okay see uh somebody from your past wants to come back to you cancer to be very honest with you they still see a lot of uh, potential in the situation they are still very much attracted to you even though may, might be they are having someone else in their life they are uh, still attracted to you also they want to come towards you like confess to you express to you but they are in some kind of mental jail they are overthinking about this constantly thinking about this making it worse in their mind making like lots of negative scenarios in their mind and uh, not taking any kind of action although they want to but they are not going to do it So I don't see a past person, past energy coming back towards you. 
they are constantly thinking about you about the situation but not doing anything about it because they feel right now this is not the right time uh, they are like spying on you from a distance keeping tabs on you from a distance but again not doing anything about it physically let's see what is the guidance for you people cancer in the situation let's see what's happening we have the five of wands the knight of cups and the five of swords okay see mm -hmm. if you feel like you should confess to something uh, like someone confess or express or apologize to someone do that don't let your ego come in between you and your forgiveness or asking for forgiveness kind of thing and if you're waiting for someone to come towards you and ask for forgiveness from you drop that you have to drop your ego in both the cases if you are not getting a proper closure or if you are not able to connect with new people, new situations the way you want to be, it's completely fine. It's completely fine. Don't uh, like beat yourself up for that. Don't uh, like uh, uh, ruin your energies for that. If you are uh, like uh, ready to like, if you are in this energy of okay, I should get a proper closure. You're not getting it. This is high time for you to realize that you will never get it. You have to accept the situation the way it is. Forgive yourself, the other person, other people involved in the situation and let it go. Let it go. Okay. And if you feel you should apologize, just do that. Don't let your ego ruin that kind of energy because it's it's a very human thing. Be the bigger person here. Okay. And for those of you who are completely single, no past energy, no past things involved in the situation. If you are not able to find the true love of your life right now, till now, it's completely okay. It's okay to feel lost. It's, it's okay to feel confused and conflicted at times. Do not let this uh, take a toll on you in a negative way. It's just a phase. It's just a thing that will pass with time. Just focus on the like good things. Pay gratitude to the universe and keep going ahead. Don't make it a huge issue. It it's, might be a huge issue for you. But for the universe, it's a teeny tiny thing. So it will be fixed just at the right time. Hmm? So thank you so much for tuning in Cancer. I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye-bye. Take care. God bless you. Namaste.